gives us the structural design for optimizing efficiency in various aspects of business. The steps of the scientific management method are, one, <laughs> find the one best way of accomplishing a task, two, recruit the best people best suited for that task, three, training candidates in the one best way of accomplishing that task, and four, sharing efficiency gains throughout the organization. These points are the basis on which a resourceful, competent, and well-organized business designs its operating blueprint. <laughs> Romero Hyundai places customer service as a high priority, and through that we can see how Taylor's scientific method works. Step one in scientific management is developing the one best method to accomplish benefits for both the patron and the company. Romero Hyundai offers online appointment scheduling as well as traditional appointments by phone. By offering these options, customers are given more opportunities to make appointments at their convenience. So having multiple options is the one best method of scheduling appointments. Step two, recruiting the right people who are suited for the job. So today we're here with Jeff and we're gonna interview him about the things that he does here at Hyundai. Jeff, did you have any prior um, sales experience before you started here at Hyundai? You know, I did. I actually started working at, uh, I started here out of high school and I transferred to another dealership called Norco Mazda where I worked there for two years. Um, I trained, I started from the bottom. I started as a parts driver. I learned um, all the different parts in the car and how to sell stuff and uh, how to acquire new customers and wholesale accounts. And then, uh, and then I started working over here a couple years after that. Okay, and um, what also would set you apart from other people that also applied for the same position you did here? Well, I had a previous experience. First of all, I started I started out here after high school. Second of all, uh, I know all the customers in the area. And uh, one of my big philosophies is there's no job too big or too small, so it doesn't matter what it is, I just get it done. And a majority of your other coworkers, did they also have experience before they came? Uh, everybody that's worked back here in this parts counter has came from another dealership or, or started here and started either from the bottom up or they've uh, came from another dealership and they've had experience either another manufacturer but doing the same type of work. Okay, thank you Jeff for doing this interview today. No problem, have a nice day. Step three, training the right people in the right way. Okay, so what we do when we have a customer call in, especially for electrical parts, we mm -hmm. have to know all the information about the vehicles. So one of the first questions I ask the customer is what's the last eight digits of the VIN number? And you need to know the last eight digits because it breaks it apart by year and what functions that the car comes with. Okay. So we put the last eight of the VIN number in the computer and it brings up the right car if I was in the right catalog. The customer is requesting a headlamp switch, okay. which is going to be in the electrical section. The electrical section is right over here. They don't train you for a slow computer. It happens. Five function switches, and there it is. Step four, sharing efficiency gains throughout the organization. Every customer of Romero Motors gets a customer service survey to see how their experience was. So Romero Motors pays all their employees based off the customer service score. So that means that our paychecks are based off of the incentives. So I'd like to present the Associate of the Month, Cornelia Flower, for being having the highest CSI scores of a whole dealership. Thank you. In conclusion, Romero Hyundai uses Taylor's scientific method in the following ways. Appointment scheduling, recruitment, training, and communicating improvements through incentives. Thank you, and we hope you enjoyed this video. Whips and chains, out.